Hey guys, welcome back to the gaming channel. We're not good gamers, we're just good people who play games. And today, we are going to play FIFA 19, the demo. Yes, the demo has been out for almost a week and we've been playing non-stop, but we are here to give you our very own personal and detailed review. And today, we're gonna play a very special way of playing FIFA. So if either of us score, Hakim will go out and then another player will take his place. And that is if I score. If they score, they still go out. So I'll be the constant. I'll be here throughout to give you more in-depth review. Before we start playing the game, let's just take a look into the team management right here. Okay, one thing that really stood out to me is that the whole layout, the whole layout of the team management. See, we can press L2 and we can even edit game plans here. Wow, this is when you adjust your attacking and defensive intensity. You can actually tell you if you're ultra attacking, you're playing possession, you can play constant pressure. All this stuff goes into very minor details and this is just the demo. By the way guys, this is not the final build. And uh, another thing that really stood out to me was this, the layout for the tactics. Now this is super simplified. All you have to do is just switch, balance, drop back, constant pressure, and uh, you can even adjust the width and the depth. Of it. This kind of reminds me of the football manager. Yes, it's something like football manager, honestly. Yeah. It gives you that detailed touch. It's very simple to use and it gives you a lot of freedom to adjust. And we shall begin! Let's go. Alright, so one thing I noticed about the game is that now on defense, it's super reactive, honestly. It's easier to control on defense, see? Uh, higher chances of you interacting with the ball and how you want your defenders to be. But the only problem I have is their human reaction though. I mean, look look at this. Look at the reaction. Oh. I mean, it's it's so realistic. And that's the problem. It's too realistic in my opinion. It becomes super clunky and draggy. And then again, mad props to FIFA for trying to make the game as realistic as possible. That was... Yeah, that's a goal. Uh, it wasn't a bicycle kick goal, but it was still a goal. Okay guys, next better player. Hi Shafi, you're here just in time to see my goal. Wow, okay. Yeah. Great, yeah. great, cool. Okay, to be fair, I've not played this in a long time, but... But it actually feels much smoother, I would say, compared to like the passing is so precise. In really? My opinion. Yeah, yeah. Oh, the passing is precise. Yeah, it is. Okay, Wait, right. So, do you not like the passing actually? I mean, I'm more of a one-touch passer. I'm, I'm more of a tiki taka kind of guy, okay, and okay, okay, that, I okay. feel like tiki taka is dead in this game, in my opinion. Because of, of the, the, the human mechanics. reaction, yeah. Okay, yeah, the yeah. Human reaction. But then it feels it feels more realistic, right? I mean, maybe that's what they're trying to go. Oh, you see, as we talk, you see. Oh, you missed. Great. Yeah, see, but I, I feel like it takes forever for the initial passing guy to run. Okay, okay. You know what I mean? Like, that, that, that's that a legit... Real, real hu human leg. Yeah, real human leg. Oh, great. Oh, that was a good... Nice block, nice block. Oh. And like I said, like, it's a defender's game, honestly, in my opinion. Really? Defending is so much easier. I, I, I'm having a hard time. <laughs> oh, okay. Okay, that, that was not a block, no. I didn't, I didn't even press anything. That was pretty much the auto. AI. That yeah. was AI, that was purely yeah. AI. If you miss tackle, right, AI is going to tackle for you. Then as a opponent, it's just going to suck for you because you, you could have scored, right? Hmm, long range feels very different. Oh! Long range whoa, whoa. feels sort of different. Uh, we turned off the two timing uh, shot mechanics. What is that two timing Apparently, mechanics? there's a timed finish. Oh. Like it gives you a better chance of finishing, I guess. Okay, yeah, there you go, there you go, there, there you go. There you go. What a goal, what a goal. Good job, man. Good job. Good job. Sub right. out. Hello, Takai! Just in time to see my goal. Alright, so do tell me your thoughts on FIFA 19. It seems more to like possession and pressing. For me, I will still prefer FIFA 18. Yes, because honestly, I, I still prefer I, I feel like I have much more control over everything. I mean, it's very understandable because um, they're trying to make this game so much easier. I, I guess they try to make, make this easier for people that can't defend. Uh. I haven't really tried shooting long range, but yeah. Okay, that was my first attempt at long range. Right now, so far, Takai has shown the most promise! Aww. See, now this is the thing, you know. The camera angle is so wide, I don't need to go left or right anymore. I, I, I don't really pass. like it. It's not really getting your keeper's point of view. I, I don't really take pride in angle. Right. Who's next? So thank you, Takai. Alright guys, so over here we have Edwin. What's up? New member of our team. Wait, also, which team am I? You are Juventus. <laughs> oh, and I'm Real Madrid. Okay, yes. Have you played FIFA 19 yet? No. So is this your first time playing? Yes, this is my first time All playing. Alright. I do play FIFA 18 though. You play FIFA 18? Uh, I haven't been playing it. I played it when it just got released. Oh my god. No, 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 you, no, no! <laughs> Yeah, like. And how is defending easy? Oh my god, it's so difficult. 
Hey, Riff! Oh wow. Do you feel like it's slightly heavier? Sort of, I guess. How did I lose that ball? Mm -hmm. so, okay, you know what? I will, I will give you a chance to, to attack because I want to show something. Look at this, guys. When I change to keeper mode. Oh, wait. Oh, wait. I, you can't really see. All right, out. I was about to say, <laughs> when you change to keeper mode, the camera angle changes as well. You know what? I'll, I'll show you a footage maybe now. All right, so this is the footage when you change to keeper mode in a game. So oh, yeah. Out now? Yeah, you're out. Okay. Last person to join us is Mr. Afik. He's also behind the camera. This is Bye, guys. Guy. Alright, guys. So, this is Afik, also one of our newest members for our production team. Sadly, he had to come at the 90th minute because yeah. it's, it's gonna end soon. Uh, have you played FIFA 19 before? Yep. How do you think? What do you think about it? It feels like they notched down the pace of the game. I think it's way slower now. And like you said, Tiki Taka is dead because yes, as Tiki you Taka can see so here, I can't make that one touch. Yeah, the place. initial pass, the oh, reaction yeah. time is... Wow. 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 I make such a difference. <laughs> but you also believe that Tiki Taka is dead. Yeah, even I play for a short while, I really can feel that it's very heavy. Passes are way more heavier than it used to be. Alright. So yeah. Well, thank you for joining me. I'll take my leave right now. Yes, thank you very much. Alright guys, so you've seen FIFA 19 demo from us, our perspective, and I have to give my honest opinion. Alright. I think that this has got to be one of the worst. FIFA demos I've ever played, honestly. Did I hear something that I'm about to win? You know what? I'm about to win this! Yeah, you know what? Let's just continue on. Alright, Ridwan, so tell me, I mean, you actually played the FIFA 19 demo before I did. Yes, I did. So tell me, what's your personal experience? I feel um, I, I have to adapt to the... The first touches are very different. Mm -hmm. It has more, it gives me more room to maneuver because I, I'm a dribbler. What I do not like about it is uh, Manchester United doesn't, it's not a very good thing for this season. Really? Yeah. Oh, okay. Yeah. It's not a very good team. Are you sure it's the team and not the actual player itself? I think the team. Would you prefer FIFA 18 or 19, honestly? Sadly, FIFA 18. Right? But then again, you have to keep in mind that this is a demo build and they are constantly fixing... Oh, they are? Yep. And they are constantly fixing the bugs and differences in the game and stuff like oh, that. Oh, that's good. Yes, uh, That's a bug. They have to fix that. They have to fix the bug where the player has to be better than the actual team. Bugs everywhere. <laughs> have you actually experienced the two ti the timed finishes? No. Do you think that it is actually practical? I have not practiced it. I think I, I, I've encountered it when I my experience during the demo playing with Chen Hao, but I've not mastered it very well. You know what guys, let's turn on the two time touch. So time finishing is actually to trigger a time finish by double tapping the button assigned to the shoot action when attempting a strike. The precision and timing of the second button Tap determines the result of the contact. Perfectly timed strikes increase the shot accuracy and power, while poorly timed contacts can make the shot more likely to miss the mark. Do you, do you understand what it means? No. Let me try. I don't see the, the I bar. I don't see though. the bar? Yeah, I don't see the bar. Where is the bar? It's gonna be my first freaking goal, actually. It's not. It's gonna be my first freaking goal. No. I feel pain. Oh. Oh. Delusional. You gotta fix those bugs in your mind. Give me the ball. I'm trying to do. Ah. Yep, there's no time finish. There wasn't any bar. And I'm just taking shots just to try. Shoot button? I don't think so, my god. Do you see that dive header animation? Uh. The guy was like floating in air. <laughs> yeah, I'm very impressed by the details eh, of each player. So yeah, I see how Neymar often try to get a free kick. Alright guys, so we realise why the bar did not show up. It's because we have to turn on our trainer. Alright, so the bar will show up. Sprint hold R2. <laughs> okay. I know how to play the game, okay? I know how to play the game. All right. Oh, oh. there. There's a, there's, there's a green highlight. There's a green highlight, yes, but I didn't see any bar, though. Okay. Oh, wow. Goal! All right. First half is done. 2-1. Uh, Actually, you know what? I'm just going to turn off my, my assist. <laughs> right now, our goal is to just get the, the green highlight. Green highlight. The green highlight over our icon. Oh wow, good passing, good passing. Where, where, where was this the whole time just now one? Impressive passing game, son. I am impressed. Ah! Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Oh, it was yellow. Yellow, oh it was yellow. The icon was yellow. You tried, you tried to do the double tap? Yep, I did try. Oh, 
Green. Oh, it was green. No, it was green. It was it was green. green. No. What a good long pass. <laughs> Insightful indeed. Inside the goal post. I really tried to do the double tap. I must say, the, even though the new feature is there, I think I don't need that new feature to win. So what are the new changes of, about the game so far that you maybe search up? Besides time finishing... Um, no, me. I know there are a few game modes, but they didn't release it in the demo. No, they did not. We can't even play a normal quick match. This is purely for... Uh, a UCL mode, the Champions League mode. I oh, there's one more feature also. It's like, uh, you know, do you see like there is a faint arrow? So it actually tells you like uh, the suggested next yeah, player. Yeah, suggested next player. I think that sometimes spoil it for the player. So your element of surprise is gone. Yeah, and then the opponent will predict, oh, you're going to go to that guy. Okay, then. When it comes to like maybe actually defending, it's still the same. It comes down to skill. But when it comes to controlling your player to chase down a player that's when it gets slightly easier so your players will actually challenge for the ball easier oh wow oh it's a draw oh, it's a draw i don't think it, it's bad but i just maybe it's just me that you know there will always be a part of you where you're very attached to the last version of the game and then mm -hmm. when there's a new update you're not very um comfortable with the changes but Correct. i feel like it's it takes time. It it takes maybe time. it will take a few rounds of playing. I honestly think that this might be one of the worst FIFA of all time. I'm a FIFA fan. In, in my personal opinion. For now, based on the demo. But yes guys, do remember to leave down in the comments below what you think of this game if you have played it before and if you haven't, well, FIFA is coming out next week so you should try that out for yourself. Pre-order the game right now. Alright guys, so do remember to subscribe to the channel, like this video and see you guys next time.